4.1.3 asks you to identify and understand the standard error values associated with using formulas. These are the name error, the divide by zero, and the reference error. So what do we mean? If Excel doesn't understand what you want and can't do the calculation, it will show you one of these errors. So here we have an example. It's doing five times zero and giving the answer of zero. And you can see that in the formula in the formula bar at the top here. And if I click in here, Excel can tell where these are. And in fact, it highlights them in those colors for you to be able to see. So I can make it so that it doesn't understand one of these values. If I get rid of the six in the B6, you see the coloring disappears from B6. And when I press the Enter key, Excel can no longer work out what to do. And so it gives you a name error. In other words, it doesn't know what the name of the cell is that you're trying to talk about here. Divide by zero is a pretty straightforward error. This calculation is doing B7 divided by C7, and the divide by C7, the C7 here, is a three. If I change that three to a zero, that's a mathematical impossibility. You can't divide things by zero, and so Excel is telling you that. And that leaves us with the reference. In this case, we've got B8 times C8. Now that involves the blue cell and the green cell. And the reference is where we get rid of one of those cells. So if I click on the five and delete that, the cell has gone. It's been replaced and you can see the cells have been moved up. And now we're getting the error message that says I can't refer to that cell because the one that was in the question has disappeared. 